Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Valerie Dyson and today I am showing you how I created this very pretty um, bluish green eyeshadow look. I got inspiration by the top that I am wearing and also I really wanted to use one of my J Cat Prismatic um, eyeshadows that DD5 um, gave me in our last box swap we had. If you haven't seen that video, um, definitely check it out. It was one of my more recent videos, but this is the, I'll put it on the screen right here, what it's called, because I cannot pronounce it, but it's the J-Cat Prismatic, um, pigments, and this is the color right here on the screen. If you're interested in seeing how I created this look, then just keep on watching. First product that I'm going to use is the Joa Truly Yours Dark Circle Concealer to uh, do. I'm going to use this as a base for my eyeshadow. So I'm going to start off by using this Isadora Eyeshadow um, Quad. It's called 14 Peach Avenue. And I'm going to start off with this color right here just to uh, set a base to the eyeshadow look. Alright, I'm going to use the same eyeshadow palette and I'm going in with this color right here. This peachy, almost like a blush color with a big fluffy brush. And I'm just going to go kind of above my crease and use this as a transition shade. Alright, and now I'm going to use this J Cat um, Chromatic Pigment in the color Unico Unicopia, Uni how do you say it? Unicopia? I can't say it. I'll put it here on the screen, how you, how it's spelled. <laughs> but this is the star of the show, so I'm gonna do this, and I'm gonna put this on my whole lid, maybe a little bit above my natural crease, that way you can see it with my hooded eyes. All right. Um, the same Isadora eyeshadow palette or quad and I'm gonna go in with this darker shade right here and I'm gonna put that on the outer V and then blend it out all right now I'm gonna use my Ico black magic liquid eyeliner and I'm going to line my eyes with this use it I'm gonna do like a little bit of a cat wing actually or cat wing cat eye um just in case you're new here I got this eyeliner and a few of the other products that I am using in this video from my good friend Ida from our last box swap and if you have not seen that video already you should check my most recent videos and watch it. Now I'm going to use my Joa Lash Up Rising Volumizing and Lengthening Mascara to coat my lashes before going in with falsies. Now I'm going to use my Kiss Little Black Dress Eyelashes right here and I'm going to use my Kiss Lash Strip Adhesive to apply my lashes. Next I'm going to prime my face using the Joa Instant Prime Activator Hydrating and Brightening Primer. Now I'm going to use the Joa Truly Yours Dark Circle Concealer in the color Brightening to um, conceal these dark circles and right here where my nose turns blue every time it bumps. Now I'm going to use the Catrice uh, Cosmetics HD Liquid Coverage Foundation, and I have the color 20 Rose, what, Rose Beige, and this is going to be my foundation. Now I'm going to use my Milani 01 Translucent Light to Medium Powder to set the face. Now I'm going to use the Joa Brow Down To Me Precision Brow Pencil in the color Warm Medium Brown to do my brows. I'm going to go back in with this Isadora Quad and I'm going to use the dark brown shade on the 
outer corner and then I'm also going to be using that um, J-Cat Prismatic, Prismatic, Prismatic Chrome um, pigment on the inner corner to do the lower lash line. All right, so I'm going to use this Sunkissed, Pretty Sunkissed Bronzer. And a lot of you guys was asking about it. So, ow, I did look it up. And I really couldn't find anything, like, any kind of stores that I personally would buy off of. If you know, let me know in the comments below. But I will say this is a very good formula. I love it. So far, so good. It's a very nice bronzer with a illumination. So it's not like a glow by any means at all um but it's not matte either i mean i guess it would be like a matte or but at least i don't know how to explain it but i like it a lot and it blends out very nicely like and i did see that this is probably more like a drugstore kind of pricing for a bronzer um but nowhere that I would buy off of. Um, so, yeah, I can't really link it. But I will say, if you do see this brand Sunkissed, pick, pick some more stuff out of from it because it's really nice. For blush, I'm using my Milani um, Zero Two Floral Fantasy trio palette and I'm going to use that middle shade right there to blush up the face. For highlighter I'm going to use my Ofra highlighter in the color Beverly Hills and let's see I think I'll mix these two colors together. Might be too dark. Oh yeah that's way too dark. Okay. I'm going to do these two right here. That's better. So I guess I'll use <laughs> those three colors on the other side to do the highlight. <laughs> right now I'm going to use this Milani Understatement Lip Liner in the color 160 Cafe Latte. I guess that's how you say it. <laughs> to align my lips. Right now I'm going in with the Joa Lip Gloss in the color Stardust. And this is going to be my gloss. And I'm going to finish up this makeup look setting my face with the Kaya, I think how you pronounce it. That Extra Hydration Moisturizing Setting Spray. Alright, that's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed. And like I said before, the inspiration to this was the J-Cat prismatic um pigment in this color right here on the screen and yeah um i'll i really love this look it goes great with the shirt i am wearing which i'm not really doing nothing today i'm hoping i can find some i call a dollar general today that's pretty much it <laughs> staying at the house but yeah i hope you enjoy this video um i will have the makeup that i put on in this video linked in the description box below so check it out if you're interested. And to everyone, I hope to see you on my next video. Bye.